this is an induction heater that I uh, showed you some of you last year um, and I was hoping to make it do something slightly useful um, now this that I just made is a little pot I made a slightly larger one um, just now and it didn't work I think it's just too big for this little uh, this little heater so I made a smaller one and the idea is that we put that in there um, the induction heater turns on because it's steel it'll get hot um, and then we can fill it full of solder um, to make a solder pot for basically the purpose is to tin ends of wires um, you can do it with a soldering iron but if you've got lots to do it's nice to just have a pot that you can just dip the wire in and it comes out all nicely tinned ready to go um, so let's see if it works Clipping the power on. It's smoking. Oh, oh, solder's melting. I'm going to burn a hole in my desk. Might have to get plumbing solder. <laughs> this stuff's too thin. Right, so that's already working better than last time. Mm, that is very much working. What I'll have to do is make a little temperature controller for it. There we are, we've got a nice little pot full of solder. Strip a bit of wire and we will try it out. Now the other thing I'll have to get is some flux so that the um, solder flows nicely. Let's just let that... Um... Oh, it's still liquid actually. Instantly tinned wire, if I can get it to focus. Ends blade out, but that's just because I fluxed it up. Oh, right, that's getting a bit hot. <laughs> Ooh. Roasty, toasty. Right, well that was just a little experiment um, on my part to see if that would work um, and it does uh, it needs a bit more control because this thing just keeps heating without any sort of feedback at the moment so I need to be able to turn it on and off to regulate the temperature um, so I think that's a little a little project to go on the list uh, for the future uh, make a little induction heater uh, solder pot because I mean that liquefies in yeah, 10 seconds or so uh, it's quite impressively fast uh, it just needs a little bit of uh, refinement so pleased with that little experiment not sure there's much else to say on that one for the moment uh, thanks for watching see you next time